this comes up. All right, so here we've got version 2.0 of the uh, washing machine. We had a major rebuild in the drive system. Uh, instead of the uh, tube inside tube, which was basically a friction bearing uh, deal, we've used the crank set off a mountain bike, welded in. So now we've got um, something that's specifically designed to seal water out and to uh, to rotate really well. Um, and we got to reuse a uh, old mountain bike hub. So it looks really good on the outside. On the inside, you get a shot there. We cut off a, a, a crank pedal off a mountain bike and then just attach it through and we got really good rolling action. It's beautiful. Everything else is the same. Uh, this is going to be, this is uh, Gavin and I's dirty laundry. And, uh, oh, Javier's as well. We've got some underwear. It's good. Some shirts. It's Javier's underwear. Uh, it's Wouldn't my, touch it's it. It's my underwear. Oh, you guys share underwear. <laughs> um, stick our soap right here. Works the same. Everything else works the same as before. Oh, we do have a little upgrade. We included a viewing window this time. Keeps flashes out, and we can watch the water level go up. Um, everything attaches like so. And first, we gotta actually use this. And put it on. So the beauty about this is we get to recycle a whole barrel. So people. I just put it on before I put it on the barrel. Seems a lot more painful than it really is. Seal it up. The beauty about this system, uh, this washing machine, is that right now the uh, women of the local town go to those hand scrubbers. It's a big uh, collection of, well, kind of like what uh, we have here. These ridged concrete uh, scrubbing areas, and uh, they scrub for hours and hours. And when we were talking to them, talking, their hands are tired and they're worn out. And uh, here we just fill it up with water and pedal away. We have three cycles: 15-minute wash and two 15-minute rinses. Works really good. Just if you set it up right.